Here we are, one more day, I'm still not a professional blogger, I still didn't receive any free clothes from any famous brand, Kylie Jenner didn't contact me, I hope that this time it will turn out good. <laughs> if somebody wants to collaborate with me, you know, my social media down below. <clears throat> I always accept free stuff. In case you didn't know, some months ago I started writing in a blog and basically there I tackle fashion, art and what are their connections and my last post, which I really recommend on reading, not because I wrote it of course, but it's actually very interesting because I am talking about the three most iconic and stunning um, collections in which famous fashion designers collaborated with painters or sculptures. So inspired in my blog post, in this video I'm not going to be alone. I'm going to be with a special um, guest. Hi! He's a Sid and he's one of my best friends. We met here last September during the Erasmus. He's a product engineer, designer. <laughs> <laughs> For the last um, four takes, we tried to be serious and I tried to introduce him, but it was impossible for us. No. So it's better that he introduces himself. His name is Asier. My name is Asier. I'm 22 years old and I study product design. We met last September here during the Erasmus in Belgium and he's one of my best friends. And for today's video, we will be doing a challenge, which is combining both famous paintings with all my clothes here. We're going to be using today this random spin wheel generator. And here we wrote all the different paintings, which were chosen by our best friends and Kisses and hugs from here, guys. We love you. They gave us the name of eight different paintings, but we don't want this video to be eternal. So we are just going to choose three. Yeah. Once we have each one of them, I'm going to display all my clothes, my shoes and everything on top of my bed for Asier. And he will need to choose, inspired in those paintings, an outfit that describes at least the vibe that that painting gives him. Honestly, I must confess that I am a little bit afraid because I will be the model. So all these clothes are going to be on me. And I said it's nothing to the fashion world. So I don't know he's going how he's going to combine all these different stuff. Also because he has to choose between accessories, not just a sweater and pants. <clears throat> I said, are you confident of yourself? Yeah, I think so. You think you're going to do good? Yes. Okay. Let's see. Ah. Let's start with the first one. Oh, very, very easy. The Mona Lisa. Duh. This is my bed right now. And I'm going to <clears throat> put all my clothes in the bed in three, two, one. So here are all my clothes, or almost all. These are tops, these are tops, those are tops. These are also tops, but with long sleeves, pants, jeans, joggers, absolutely everything. Here I took out some of my accessories. And there, here, we find all my shoes displayed here and my sweaters and belts and absolutely everything. He has a lot to choose. Also, I need to do a little bit of a disclaimer since we always talk in Spanish between us. 
And it's a little bit weird for us to talk now in English, so in case you notice some uh, weird vibes, that's the reason why. Yes. Sorry. I said. Hi. <laughs> I'm going to leave my phone here, okay? Okay. But don't tell me anything. I will be just waiting outside, but you will be filmed, okay? Okay. Don't do stupid things in camera. <laughs> Said you can come already. Okay. <laughs> What the fuck? Okay. <laughs> okay. I'm going to try this and um, I will inform you soon, okay? okay I am sweating. But please, Asir, explain us your inspiration. I took the main colors of the painting and yeah, I used like brown colors. And the green? And the green because the background of the Mona Lisa is this, green. This bright? It's not that bright that you didn't have anything green. Okay. Like dark green. Honestly, to this outfit from 0 to 10, like, I would give it maybe an 8 because I would wear it <laughs> outside. <laughs> But please let me know in the comments. Let's go for the second one. Yes. I'm scared. The Starry Night. Why are we just getting the most popular ones? I don't know. What do you think? I don't really like it. You don't like it? Why you don't like it? What did inspire you? What did? I try to use the dark colors, but also with bright colors of the stars that they are used in the top. Okay. And then I wanted to give soft movement to the style, yeah. with the lines of okay. the trousers on the top. But I have to say that you chose white shoes and in the whole yeah, painting there yeah. is no white. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I like the bright color. Also, I need to say that uh, it was my fault not remarking that we are not in winter because I am sweating all the time and Asir is just putting me more and more clothes on top, so... <clears throat> yeah, but let's go to the last one. I yeah. hope it's the best too. We will see. Asir wanted to have the honor of saying... <laughs> okay, the last one. <laughs> The kiss. the kiss! Okay, okay. Woo! Inspiration, Sassir. So yes, I took the main color of the painting, and it's uh, yellow. Uh, it's used in the top and also in the top it's full of yeah, dots and yeah uh, the painting is also full of patterns so yeah but i don't think that this really looks like the kiss yeah but uh, the painting of the kiss it has also like really green colors but the problem is that the other top it was really bright so i chose this one Okay, um, as you can see uh, from the expression in my face, this is my least favorite, so in this case it was last and least, sadly. Okay, conclusions. My last thoughts. In my opinion, the first one was actually very accurate and I would be, I see myself wearing that because it's very casual, not formal. The second one, just as you said right now, it's basically to go and work. 
Yeah, that's really serious outfit. Yes, and too hot. And the third one, like I look right now. What did you just tell me that I look like? That I'm going it's to? It's like for a picnic. Totally. I feel like Mary Poppins or <laughs> somewhere from there. And for me, the best one was actually the second one. For me also. But because I think that you really chose the best colors and yeah. the best patterns and yeah. you did a very good job. Mm. Like I, I thought that, honestly, I thought that he was going just to stick to the basics, but he tried different styles, which is very nice. But honestly, the opinion that I want to know the most about is yours. Leave down below in the comments or just text me on one of my social media. Which one was your favorite outfit and how would you have combined it if it was you and not my friend Asier? As always, you have all my social media down below, also on screen, but this time you have also Asier's networks, in, he's in all the different social media, but I must say that he paints and he's a very, very nice artist. So I leave also his Instagram here below if you want to check it out. And if you like this video, please comment it below, subscribe, and don't forget to share a lot of love. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Because Asier is not into the fashion world and he dresses in a very simple way. So, so the model is again. <laughs> Yay! With the first one.